How the heck are you, everybody? I'm Fastidious. Welcome to my channel, and welcome to a very fun day on this here channel. We are not in my account. We are in the account of God's Gift to Ladies. This is AJ. I've known AJ for almost as long as I've been playing the game. We've done some takeovers for him. We've done many, many a polls for him. Thank you very much, Gareth, for joining as a member. Anyone can join as a member if they'd like. And today we are doing some crazy stuff that him and I have been discussing for at least a month, if not two months. So he's definitely a spender. Call him a whale if you'd like, call him a dolphin if you'd like, but he's also a saver. So he spends, he buys lots of deals, but he saves. So he's got 50,000 diamonds. He's not a content creator, he just buys them and then waits for the right moment. Same token, he has 204 ancient summoning crystals. He has got 55 divine summoning crystals and then 130, he's gonna pull the rare crystals, right? But he saves his diamonds, he saves his ancient summoning crystals, and you better believe he's saving those divines. Holy guacamole, hell Hades into the chat. He's saying holy, that is accurate. Holy guacamole indeed. This is crazy what he's, what he's amassed here. I've probably seen higher like once ever in the game. And what's really cool that AJ did is he's got it everywhere, right? We've got the diamonds, we've got the ancients, and we've got the divines. We're doing everything today. So we're gonna start it off with a one plus one. We'll just go, we'll do our rares. If we don't hit it by then, we'll go into the diamonds. Once we hit that, We'll take a breather. Then we're gonna immediately jump into our divine summons. We've got 55 of these bad boys. You can only single pull them. So we're gonna go one after the other. And I'm gonna show you the roster in a second. This actually isn't a bad banner for him since he has so many heroes. So having a nice open pool gives him a good opportunity to get the dupes that he needs as opposed to like when there's a 10X or something and he might be restricted or he feels like he's waiting around for the 10X he needs. And then you're sitting on this forever. So we want to wait for the new year. It's New Year's weekend. New Year's Eve is tomorrow. So why not do it? Maddie, Ho Maddie Hoodless is saying the self-discipline of this gentleman is unmatched. Honestly, it is. Because, yeah, he is a spender, but he's been saving this stuff for like two months. So he's been buying and then not using. So he's, he's, it's, it's like a, he's, he's a spender, but a very prudent spender, if you will. Very wise. Buddhist monk, monk level discipline, says Gareth. I don't disagree. Uh, so we're gonna enjoy that and then of course we'll go over to the ancient summons He's a few ancient pulls into pity if not more than a few so we're guaranteed with worst case comes We'll hit the 220 we'll get pity, but I predict we're gonna get a few a few legendaries I'm feeling pretty hard hyped and we're certainly gonna get a legendary Lord. So let's get into it Let's check out this account. So what is the guy working with? No, we don't need deals We have plenty of resources. We don't need any special deals. He's got some great stuff We've done many a pull for AJ both on and off stream. You can see your A4 Cetrum, I'm not jealous at all. A4 Silas, boy oh boy. A2 Virna, A1 Zila 2. I'm just gonna shout out the real Ws. We got A0, but it's hot sit in her new skin. Looking very cool. A4 Valeria, be really nice if we pull Valeria. Her A5 is cracked. We've got A3 Comet, A1 Eloin. We could use some arrogance dupes, we only have MA0. A1 Salazar, we've got Serb, only A0, so we could use some Cerberus dupes. Uh, what else we got? He's got Captain Reeve, some nice uh, ancient exclusives here. We got Carnelian, we got Thalon. You're seeing tons of OG lords, right? I'm just seeing if anyone else. There's an amazing ancient exclusive lord. We've got Elder already. He already pulled Pelagios last week or the week before. Absolutely nuts. I think this was two weeks ago he pulled Pelagios. That's amazing. Uh, what else we got? Yeah, so you can see crazy stuff jumping off the page. And look how many lords he actually has. So we're really looking for ancient exclusive lords. But if we pull OG lords, it, it never hurts to get dupes. Getting an A2 on a lord is incredible. Uh... He thinks he's about 50 ancients into pity. So certainly we will, we're gonna get a legendary Lord today. So he's got Torador, he's got Morrigan. I know I saw King Hearts. Um, I believe I saw something else too. Uh, so we got plenty, maybe, maybe that was it. That was it. I mean, he's juiced up, right? Juice to the gills, but everyone could always use a little bit more juice. So let's just, without further ado, get into it. We're gonna work up to the hype. I mean, the whole thing is gonna be hype, but we're gonna start on that one plus one. Hopefully we hit it nice and early. Then we're gonna do our 55 divines, 55 divines, that is nutty. And then we've got 200, what was it? 204 ancients. After this, I'm gonna pull 33 ancients of my own. Uh, those are what I've amassed free to play, right? My diamonds can't buy me ancients. And I was, I was very impressed with myself to have 33. The guy has gone and done me 7x. So bravo to you, AJ. Without further ado, let's get into it. So surprise, Invocation of Spirits. Always make sure you're on the correct banner. Let's pull, baby. Let's pull. And we're starting off with rare tax. Starting off with some nice rare tax. I, we better see a Sorzy boy. Give me a Sorzis. No, but double Voltus. Does it mean something? We never know. Let's go. 
Some more tax. All right. This is good. Get the tax out of the way bright and early. We're going to be paying a lot of tax for something really special. It's got to be that way, right? It's got to be that way. Double Narvi at the end. So we had double Voltus, now double Narvi. What does it mean? And another tax round. Boy, oh boy. Boy, oh boy. And we're now, that's crazy, though. Three temples and we're 20th place. 20th place there. Uh, and there's a Sorzy boy. All right, so that's what we've been looking for. If we're going to hit a rare, we want to get a Sorzus. Let's keep going here. And it's more tax. Oh, my sweet God. We're 0 for 40 right now. Not even a purple. 0 for 40. Jeez Louise. All right, this 1 plus 1 better be juiced up. This better be an amazing 1 plus 1. Another tax. We're 0 for 50. <laughs> I don't this is not how I expected this to start. This is not what I. This is not how I expected this to go. Uh, Voltus and a Lucas, and then eight, eight uncommons. Jeez, are we gonna go 0 for six? We are. Oh my god! <laughs> Ray's in the chat saying this is my life. We are. That's 60 pulls in a row without an epic. Oh my god. <laughs> All right, we gotta we gotta like click off the screen and click back on. We gotta do some kind of coding reset. Click onto the gallery. Let's click onto Volca, our free to play goddess. Let's spin her around a few times. I don't know. We gotta do something. That's we're over six. That we're over sixty. My God. All right, let's click back on. Click off. Click on. All right, come on. At least an epic. Okay, we got an epic. We got an epic. All right. Wow. Thank Jesus. <laughs> My gosh. That is unbelievable. There is I. Ray's in the chat saying he went 11 10 pulls in a row with nothing better than a rare. That's crazy. We'll take the I. That's a nice little palate cleanser after whatever madness that was. Uh, let's go. All right, now we got the epics. All right, we reset it. We reset it. We reset it. If that ever happens, if you get like four or five in a row, click off. I don't know if it actually works, but it certainly couldn't, couldn't get worse, right? So you got to change it up just a little bit. Let's go in here. All right, it totally worked. It totally works. Epic again. Epic again. So ever since we clicked off, we got three epic rounds in a row. We'll take those points. I want to see if we can win his group. The divines are going to help. 55 divines, that's definitely going to help. All right, so we're getting closer to that pity now. We started at we're about 135, and then we got nine. Uh, so I guess we are about 90 pulls deep. So we're about halfway there. Let's see now. I sent more epics. So it's totally working now. Our luck is turning. So hopefully we keep building and building. We're snowballing with luck. Leading up to something tremendous. There's a Scorchy boy. Thank you very much for joining, Chubby Stubby. If anyone wants to join as a member, it's always appreciated. I appreciate that, Chubby. Uh, let's go here. Joining is like the YouTube equivalent of subbing on Twitch. Again, dude, we haven't missed an epic. Uh, since we clicked off. There's a Theowin. We're not going to find a single epic he doesn't have. Don't worry, guys. Don't worry. Yeah, actually, Matty Hoodless is making a good point. There's nothing wrong with... A epic again, guys. There's nothing wrong with doing tax rounds because at least you can sell all those rares for diamonds when you have an account this built out, right? There's no, there's no epics he's looking for, so might as well get as many rares as possible and then you get diamonds back. And those diamonds can be reinvested towards stamina or maybe some more pulls and getting legendaries in the future. So there's a Mari and there's a Sorzy boy, a little Sorzus. Okay, finally we pay tax again. It was time that we needed uh, some tax. It was time for some tax. There's another Sorzus. So two Sorzus, two temples, two Sorzus. I like it. Something good is coming very soon. I right, so another epic. We're back on. We're back on track. We are back on track. Brack, brack. There's a mall. There's a sirene. There's a komodo. I never know if it's komodo or komodo. I'm sure the chat will tell me right now. Um, all right, and we are into our diamonds. So we're probably gonna dip, dip. We're actually we're about to dip below 50k. I know the feeling, my man. I know the feeling. There's an epic round. Everyone keeps saying Cratch incoming. All right, so his wish list is Silas, Setrum, and Valeria. No, no uh, surprise there, right? Those are the ones he has at A4. All three of them will be even more cracked out. Not cratched out, cracked out when they get to A5. There's a Sorzus. I really hope we get at least one of those three. That'd be really fun. All right, what's it going to be? Some taxi tax. Komudu. <laughs> Komudu, says Sorgion. I certainly don't think that's it. Uh, so there we go. Okay, I'm trying to gauge where we're at. I should have kept a tracker, but... I think we're probably about 150 or maybe 160. We're probably about 160 in. We should be hitting pity in the next five temples. No question. All right, there's a tax round. 
People are asking what's up with Sorzis. Uh, he actually is a solid rare, but no, he's just for good luck. I think he's the most common rare, so I like to say when he shows up that it's good luck. Because why wouldn't it be? All right, there we go. Some epics. It looks like we're going to go to full pity here. Looks like we're going to go to full pity. There's a vortex. I really, so speaking of, I think vortex is the most, uh, vortex. I think Sorzis is the most common rare. From my study, I really think vortex is the most common. I mean, a study showed that he was the most common epic, uh, but I do believe he's in the most common epic, or at least he's in the, the most common epic pool. He drops like insane. Another epic. All right, we're going to be hitting pity in the next two, two to three temples, no question. No question. Let's just click through this. There's no time. Too much to do. Theowin, fusible? No, thank you. Another epic. Come on, baby. We did pay a lot of tax at the beginning, but there have been a lot of epics lately. There have been a lot of epics lately. There's Voroth. All right, I think it's going to be this temple or the next one. So let's see. And that's it, baby. That's it. Let's see who we're going to get. Come on. We want Valeria, Cetrum, or, uh, oh my god, who was the other one? Silas. Maybe let's get two of them. Why not? Let's get a Valeria and a Silas. All right, Regulus. We know Regulus all too well on this account. There's nothing wrong with Regulus. I use him every week in Nightmare Void Rift, but just he drops. Speaking of the most common, he must be the most common legendary. It certainly feels like that to me. And this is such a deceitful animation, right? This cinematic, you see Ajax's dragon, and then it's like, nope, Lion Boy here to save Barkley. All right, let's see who the bonus is going to be. I lost my cursor. There it is. All right, let's skip this. Let's get you that 50 diamantes. 50 diamantes. All right, let's see. I'm going to try to snipe it. Ooh, Aelin. All right. Aelin's good, though, because Aelin's very much S tier for the healer codex, but this isn't what we were looking for. Wow, though. Regulus was new. Ha! <laughs> On an account like this, how was Regulus new? He's got A4 Valeria, A4 Cetrum, A4 Silas, and Regulus was new. So that's actually a great pull for you. That blows my mind. Regulus was new. How was Regulus new? That is, that's crazy. That is crazy. Let's just quickly show all, I mean, I'm gonna have to make some room right now. Let's just quickly sell all the rares uh, so we have room. I mean, he, he made tons of room for us, but keep in mind, we're pulling like crazy. But how is that even possible that Regulus could be new? That is shocking to me. So check this out. A4 Cetrum, A4 Silas, A1 Sela 2, A2 Virna. Think of all these people. A5 Sadie. Look at all these. A4 Valeria, A3 Comet. And then that was a brand spanking new Regulus. That is so funny. And that's true. We sniped him right before the new banner. So now he's guaranteed he's not going to get Regulus if he goes for the New Year's banner tomorrow. It's actually not a bad thing. It's actually not a bad thing at all. Um, all right, but let's continue. We just made enough space. We got 55 divines to rip. So rip them we shall. 55 divines. Get hyped, people. 55 legendary summoning crystals. And it all begins right now. Let's start with an epic. So how many... Let me know in the chat what you guys think, or let me know in the comments on YouTube how many you think we're going to pull. I think we are going to pull with 55 on a 2x. I think we are going to pull... I think we're gonna pull six. I think we're gonna pull six. Petru says eight, Game says four, Zez says 54, <laughs> uh, Katakurik says seven, Grunix says five, Nick Neek agrees with me and says six. I think it's gonna be six, but ho hopefully it's, it's, it's a lot. That's all I can say. 54 remain, let's see, another epic here. Come on, baby, we're locked and loaded. Freedom says lucky number seven. All right, there's a Brienne. I love, I love my queen Brienne, but not today. We're looking for gold, baby. Another epic. This is going to be a slog, baby. We're going one by one. Let's see it. All right, another epic. We got to heat up, baby. We got to heat up. We got to get something amazing. 51 remain. We've got plenty time here. All right, no luck here. So our first five, we are 0 for 5. I hope we get one in the next five. I want to get at least one every 10. I think that would feel good. Another epic. Oof. Oof. Yeah, let me click on and off and reset our luck a little bit. Let's click out. Let's click back in. Let's move the camp around a little bit. <laughs> All right, 49 remain. We're only 60. Another epic. 
There's a Dallin. I do love myself a Dallin. Let's go. And that's our first legendary. Let's go, baby. Come on. Who's it gonna be? Who's it gonna be? Hey, Alora. All right, not the most thrilling pull for an account like this, but certainly not a bad pull. And we're off and running. So to check in, we are eight pulls in with a legendary. That's like exactly the rates, right? It's 12%. So you're expecting to get a legendary every eight to nine pulls, basically every eight and a half pulls. So exactly the rates right now. No complaints. Let's see it. And we're right back to the epic grind. That makes her A3. Okay, very strong at A3. Uh, I will say Alora benefits immensely from Awakening, so she only gets more powerful, and she's very strong at A5. So we'll definitely take her A3. That's very good. There's an I. I's a very strong hero herself. Back to the epic grind, indeed. Yeah, that's a good question. Let us know in the chat, uh, AJ, which like super overpowered legendaries you're missing besides Lords. I'd be curious to know that, too. He's got a lot of them though, right? I saw Silas, I saw Mirna, I saw Comet. Oh, you know, I didn't see a Boreas. Uh, he'll, he'll let us know. We saw Hotsit though, we saw Elowin. There's a Brunor, do not want to see a Brunor. Another epic. People want to check the gallery. Let's go till we're down to like 35, then we can check the gallery. There's a Voroth. Alrighty, alrighty. So 42 more to go. We'll stop at 40. Oh, there's a legendary, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Something big. Give me a lord, baby. I'm feeling greedy. Oh! <laughs> yes! I summoned him. No one pulls Torador like I pull Torador. I've probably pulled, maybe for viewers, for myself, I pulled one ever, right? But for viewers, I probably pulled 25. Legendary Lords, I think like 12 or 13 of them have been Torador. So that's A1 Torador for him, I believe, which is really good. Uh, A2 Torador is amazing. So you're one step closer. That's a huge pull. I would love a Torador, and he's triple S tier for the, the Zealous boss, right? The Lords of the Lord of the Sticks. Uh, yeah, I really called that. I was like, I'm greedy. I want a Lord, and boom, Torador cinematic. We will take it. All right, that's actually a good time to stop and take a peek at the gallery. Let's actually just educate ourselves on what like normal legendaries he's missing so he's not missing any fighters the only one he's missing those are all ancient exclusives uh here he's not missing any defenders because we just got him regulus you're welcome here he's only missing kai let's go to the healers he's only missing leia but she's obviously a legendary lord mages okay so mages he's missing lasir and kriya and then from the Lord group, there's Ajax, who's not a Lord, but has Lord designation. And then there's Venoma and Twin Fiend. So not so many. Uh, we're really probably hunting dupes more than anything. I don't see any straight up game changer here for him. It looks like he does have Boreas, um, unless I'm missing it. No, he doesn't have Boreas either. Okay, so that'd probably be the biggest pull for his uh, account. That'd be pretty, pretty sweet. Um, all right, we've got plenty more, guys. We got 41 to go. Let's do this thing. We got that epic. There's an Azoth. Azoth, if we didn't have so many good Infernal Guild Boss heroes, would be hype. Like, if you need a third Infernal DPS, he's, like, legitimately good, especially if you have Awakenings. Uh, but, yeah, our rates are really good right now, huh? We'll take it. Oh, not really good. They're, like, right on track. We are, what, exactly 16 in, and we've got two? I'll definitely take that. Nassault, we don't, we don't speak of Nassault. We do not speak of Nassault. There's Brian. Another epic. What's up, Robert? There's a Nassandite. Nassandite is really good because at A3, she gives, like, as long as she's deployed, she gives a map wide universal attacks, permanent attack speed buff of 30 attack speed. Very strong. Uh, so if you don't have her A3, it's something you can look forward to. Uh, all right, let's keep pulling. We're at 37. Another epic here. We're right on the rates right now. We're right on the rates. Azaz getting really greedy in the chat. Azaz saying another lord in the next 10 pulls. I mean, I wouldn't complain. I know, I know he wouldn't. There's a legendary. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. All right, Calypso. That's a huge pull. He didn't. I don't think he had A5 Calypso. This is the kind of account that obviously pulls a lot. A5 Calypso is supremely strong. She's also really good at the sticks, boss. Uh, so that will we'll absolutely take that. We'll absolutely take in, uh, in a Calypso dupe. 
I'm not sure what awakening that is for him, but we will totally take that. So rates are looking good right now, right? So we are exactly 20 in with three legendaries. So we're beating the rates. You'd expect three legendaries in about 24 to 27. Uh, so we're doing quite well. Let's continue. And that's another legendary back to back. Let's go. Oh, let's go. Let's go. And a Sadie. He actually has a five Sadie. I saw that when I checked him, checked his roster before. So that's actually, uh, that, that's 100 uh, Awakening coins, I suppose. That's a bummer. That is a bummer. But we'll definitely take it in terms of the points, and our rates are staying strong. So we're at four Legendaries now from the Divine, six total. Let's go. Now we're back to Epics. This account's making people jealous in the chat. And we're at 427 viewers. Maybe we'll beat our record. We set our record yesterday at 452. Uh, there's Amani. I love Amani. Amani is the first six star on my account. I don't regret it for a second. She was a very hard carry. There's a Theowin. So that, we're not even halfway done, people. We're still have 32 more to go. This is no joke. This is no joke at all. There's a Lightlock. I'm ready for some more gold, though. I'll tell you that much. It's not coming here, though. Robert Austin in the chat said he snagged Cyrus and Uridin this morning. That is crazy. Hopefully we have very good luck for AJ and myself as well. Let's see it. Cooling off just a bit. You get I get greedy quick. You know, we got those two legendaries back to back, and now I'm just like expecting a legendary every time. Not this time. Steven Nor Norris got Cyrus and Uridin on his first two pulls. Now that is a blessed account. And people think my pulls are rigged. Oh, Siren, we do not speak that name. Now we're getting right to the halfway point, I think. Let's check in. We're going to have to click off. The, the luck's bad. Another fusible. Exactly the halfway point, right? So we're 28 in, 27 to go. Let's click off. Let's move this little thing around again. Let's hop in. All right, 27 more. And that's a legendary. It worked, baby. It worked. It worked. Fifth one. Seventh total. Come on. Something juicy. That's not juicy. I'm not even going to address it. I'm not even going to say his name. I'm not even addressing that. We're just going on. I'm not even going to mention it. I'm not going to speak his name. That that boy's hurt me too many times. He's hurt me too many times. He's hurt me too many times. Oh, Gluttony. Gluttony can get some play. Gluttony, Gluttony's very good for Nightmare Faction Trials. I actually six-starred my Gluttony for Nightmare Faction. There's another Legendary. That's The rates are great. That's our sixth. So I called six, so I've already gotten my guess. Six out of 32. That's really, And there's A5 Valeria. Wow, we got a wish list hero. So we got Tordor, obvious. I mean, any Legendary Lord, especially someone as good as Tordor, that's a wish list. And now we got Valeria. That's that's A5 Valeria for him. That's a, that's a huge W. Let me actually show everybody. So Valeria, obviously amazing. Her A1 is very good. Ultimate increases attack speed by 100. A3, very good. Just all, during her ultimate, which is like when her big damage is coming, she's ignoring 20% of enemy defense. That's ridiculous. And then A5, oh my god. During the ultimate, there's a 50% chance to accumulate two stacks of power of sword. Uh, and this can go up to 12 stacks in total. That is so, so, so potent. Uh, increasing the stacks that you can get. Uh, is just, I think before it's at nine. Oh, it's at eight, right? So now she can get an extra four stacks. It makes a huge difference. Uh, that is supremely powerful. So we're doing really well right now. Uh, so we're, we've done 22, and I believe that was our seventh one. Am I right? Was that our seventh? The chat will let me know. That was either six or seven. I think that was six. Uh, that's really good, right? 32, and we got six. That is really good. That is really good. Six out of 32. That's very strong. Very strong rates. And we also got the one plus run, right? So we've got eight total. Let's run it back. We still got 22 to go. It's crazy. 22 sounding like a low number. The most I ever pulled was 12 <laughs> for myself after saving for a while. And now we've got, we've got 10 times more than, or 10 times, 10 summons more than that. Uh, and, it, and it doesn't even feel like much because we're just summoning like such madmen. Yeah, I hope we better get at least one more. We better get at least one more. I think seven, you could be very happy. I mean, six, you can already be happy, but seven, you should be very happy with the rates. There's Amani, my girl making another appearance. 19 to go. And there's a legendary, baby. That's number seven. That's number seven. We'll take it. We will take it. 
7 out of 37. And it's an Aelin, man. So lots of awakenings for his Aelin. Don't mind that. So we got Aelin from the 1 plus 1. Now we get it here. It's a 7. I mean, the rates, I mean, the quality. You know, there's been some amazing quality. There's been some decent quality. I'd say overall the quality is good. The rates are great. The rates are great. There is a mid on. Still 17 more chances as well. Some more bites at the apple, as I like to say. And we just tied our viewing record. We just hit 452. So one more viewer and we break our break our record. Let's see it. Not yet. All right, let's get one more. Let's get to a nice even eight. Eight out of 55 sounds very powerful, right? We got 15 more chances. We can definitely get one more, right? Maybe we'll get two more. You never know. Two more would be just slightly above the rates, right? There's a Dallin. Another epic. There's a Nasanda's dropping like it's a 30x on Nasanda. Another epic. People are saying three more. I, th I think I'd be happy with one more at this point. Two more would be very nice. Nearly to the single digits here. Nearly to the single digits. There's a Navras. Uh, 11 more to go. 11 is my favorite number. Fun fact about me. There's a Baron. I don't know if he has A5 Baron. I presume he has A5 of almost every epic. But Baron's A5 is very good. Basically, after his unyielding, he gets half his health back. That's a very strong level 5 awakening. There's Theowin. I hate pulling fusibles, especially from a divine. And there's a legendary. So we did get at least our one more. So that's eight. Come on. Something juicy. Give us Cetrum. Comet, man. That's A4 Comet. Comet's very strong at A5. So I think he'll be very happy to get A4 Comet. Let me actually see. Is it going to be a crit rate boost, a penetration boost, Rager Genato boost? All right. That's really good because, you know, he's got a very high cost ult. Maybe when we pull him Cyrus later. I hope, <laughs> on the Ancients, uh, it will go very nice. He's got an A4 Comet. That's a very, very nice one. And we've got 470 viewers, guys. This is craziness, man. I used to stream Raid Shadow Legends, and I'd average between like 8 and 12 viewers <laughs> back in 2021. How the turntables. All right, eight more chances. That's right in line with the rates. Maybe we're going to hit the 9, just like Jimmy was saying. Maybe we're going to hit the 9. All right, AJ, let's get you one more here. And people that have just joined... Don't think we're stopping at these 55 Divines. Then we have 204 Ancients to do for him. After that, we'll do 33 Ancients for me. There's a Maul. I love a Maul. All right, another Epic. <laughs> Tickle. <laughs> Dimos, a rare pull. I'm sure he has A5 Dimos, but that's always fun to see the, see the Doggo make an appearance. Another Epic. And a Sirene. The Sirene Queen. Four more chances. We can still do this thing. We can still get that nine. We're running out of time here. We still get nine would be crazy, man. Back to back Sirene. What could it mean? I'm a poet. All right, another epic. Are we going to go three Sirenes in a row? There is Laurel. We love Laurel. That is a broken hero for sure. That's an S tier epic. All right, so it's going to come down all to the last one to see if we're going to finish up at eight or nine legendaries pulled. But we can be very happy. I think we can be very happy with the quality that we've gotten. Definitely paid off for us. And it's gonna, we're going to end on an epic. But we're not done here. We're obviously not done here. We've got some special stuff to do. We have got 204 ancient summons so we're guaranteed a legendary lord and hopefully we pick up some amazing stuff along the way he saved he bought he saved he was very prudent uh and i think aj will be rewarded handsomely because this is about as good as 10x as i've ever seen in any game ever this is as good as a banner could possibly get we got 204 though so i'm gonna have to quickly make some space because we've been pulling so much all right so we're here with the ancients we got 204 of these it's been pretty successful so far so we pulled eight legendaries from the crazy divine summoning including an a5 valeria a4 comet we pulled an a1 torador pretty cool uh, we also hit the one plus one, so we pulled 10 legendaries so far today, but we are not done. Our work is not done. We have 204 ancient summoning crystals, and that's no joke, right? The chance to get a uh, legendary lord is 0.8%, so we, we are within the rates that we should get one. Plus, we are going to hit pity if we don't, and we still have a 1% chance to hit all other legendaries from the pool. So we have nearly a 2% chance, right? 
So I, I'm hoping for three legendaries. I really am. And then we should probably see tons of epic lords. There'll be a lot of points for him. And then hopefully not too much of that blue stuff. Without further ado, I think let's start off with uh, four single pulls and just to warm up, wet our palettes, and then let's get into it. I hate this animation. I'm gonna say it till the to the till the day I stop playing this game or to the day I die. I hate this animation. They need to do something about it. Two lords, let's go, says Sosa. I would love to see two lords for this account. That would be awesome. It's fairly within the rates. Like it wouldn't be shocking at all to get two lords for him. There's an Idril, and let's do one more, and then we'll do our first ten pull. Nice to pull an epic at least. And there's an Autumn. That's my girl. Best rare in the game. My favorite rare. Alright, let's, let's do our first 10 pull. Let's see what we got. The animation is so boring, says Jim. Yes, this animation is as boring as, as sin. It's as boring as anything could be. There's an Avalon and a bunch of Bubkiss. Alright, let's continue. 190 remain. I want to see some gold! I want to see that shining, shimmering splendor. We can take that Pyros. Little Pyros is sold around. We'll take four epics every day of the week. A Sorzy boy. He always brings the goods. Let us go. And we're at 523 viewers. Thank you guys so much. That blows my mind. Thank you very much. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Absolute trash. We're not even going to talk about it. Let's continue. We're not even going to talk about it. We're not even going to address it. Let's soldier on. We're not even going to address it. There's an angel. And we got our first gold. Ah! I knew it. I knew it. I said that. I knew it! I knew it! I said that! I said he's gonna get Cyrus. I even said that when he got his A4 comment. I said, we're gonna get Cyrus. This is the best pull you could get, honestly. For this account too, with his Boreas, with his Comet, with his Elowin, enormous. This is as good as it gets. I hope you're going crazy, AJ. I'm looking at the chat right now to see you. That is as good as it gets, man. That's why you save. Let's go. No, he does have Boreas. Oh, no, he doesn't have Boreas. You're right. Good point. Uh, but he'll get Boreas. That's amazing. Sire, this is game-breaking for him. That is so cool. <laughs> Desm instantly saying we could get a one. We could get another one. Uh, yeah, and what's crazy, even if we don't pull a legendary lord for AJ, we're so early on that we, when we reset the pity, the legendary lord pity kicks in at 200. He'll be set up for the next pity, so he can just save for the next 10x he wants. That is such a monumentally huge pull. He was only 50 into pity as well. So that wasn't legendary Lord pity at all. We just reset his legendary Lord pity. So I'll make a note of it for him now. Uh, so that's amazing. Uh, or I guess he'll have to count, but uh, we'll do, we'll do the arithmetic if we don't get it going. So there's Cyrus. Uh, pff, insane, insane, insane. And I called it. I called it. Uh, so let's go. So it's Cyrus and then six more, and then you have 160. So if we don't pull another Legendary Lord, you know that you're 166 into pity. And what do I say, man? Sorzy, Sorzy boy. Sorzis, he always brings the good stuff. And he brought Cyrus home. That is crazy. He is just, he's so over, he's so good. Oh, I really hope I get that kind of luck. And the music got so excited, it, it reset itself. So let's let's start the track over again. That is insanity. That is, I'm, can you tell I'm kind of speechless? That is, Desm says AJ's not answering because he fainted. <laughs> Too funny. All right, we still got 160 to go, baby. Still got 160 to go. That is crazy. I'm thrilled. That, that is crazy. And that's our 11th legendary and our second lord of the day. There's another epic lord. That's Vladov. We'll absolutely take that. You know, that's an ancient exclusive lord. 150 more to go. Only 150. I feel like I have so many with the 33 I save, and we still have five times that left for him. I'm ready for more legendaries. There's no doubt about it. We better get at least one more legendary. There's a Sorzis. This has got to mean something. Let's go. 140. Let's go. Let's go. Yes, the Ancient Pity is only for lords. People are asking the chat. Another Vladov. We're going to get that Vladov A5. Double Gorza. What could it mean? 130 remain. I think when we hit 100, we'll do a couple single pulls just uh, to... Oh, another legendary! Come on! <laughs> all in a day's work, baby. I'll be honest. I'm so happy for you, but now I'm a little worried. I wasted all the luck on you, but you deserve it, man. That is insane. Are we gonna get Pelagios now too? Are we gonna just do the whole banner? That is cracked out. Uridin, probably the best hero in the game, I think. 
And then Cyrus, I think he's my favorite lord in the game. This account just went from like A plus to S plus, man. Or probably from S to S plus. That is outrageous. Congratulations to you, AJ. That is insane. Should we get some Yuridan Awakenings or something? I mean, the 10X is alive and well. It does not get better than this. My sweet God, that is fantastic. That is unreal. Congratulations to you, sir. What an absolute beast. That is insane. <laughs> That is insane. Oh my god. We are really hitting the jackpot here. That is insanity. That is too good. My goodness gracious. There's Ein. I mean, we'll take an epic lord, but I mean, after Uridan and Cyrus, who needs an Ein in their life? We don't. <laughs> that's that's too crazy. We're cleaning up, baby. There's there's my Pyrus. We'll take it. All right. So I set it a hundred. Let's do ten singles. We gotta we gotta ease off. AJ's excited. We gotta we gotta calm down a little bit. Woo! That is that's too good. That is too good though. That is too good, man. That is too good. Ah, <laughs> oh, we're hot. We're hot. Endor Twelfth Legendary to boot. Twelve legendaries. That that ain't nothing. That ain't nothing. We don't even gonna talk about Bruno. I don't care that he's an epic. Duradel. See, I'd rather talk about Duradel than than Bruno. I have no interest in talking about Bruno. Let's do six more singles. There's Nero. Lovely. There's Skulf. Twin Fiend incoming, they say. A1 Cyrus incoming. There's Nero. Uh, Don is saying it's 125 into pity if no more legendary. That is not true. He will be 166 because there's not it's not a legendary pity on Ancient Summons. It is a legendary Lord pity. So it's not from when we pulled Urin and it's from when we pulled Cyrus. Let's do three more singles. There's a Borit. Little Borit boy. Come on. There is Aaron. Alrighty. Let's do one more and then we'll go back to the 10 pull grind. There's a Sorzy boy. Alright, I'm ready for a 10 pull. I'm ready for a 10 pull. I want one more legendary, to be honest. We got 90 more chances. I want one more legendary. I want to see that gold. I want to see that shining, shimmering gold. Another Ein. He's going to have A5 Ein. Maybe he already did. I don't know. Let's see it. There's a Brienne. Give me some gold. There it is! As I said, give me some gold. Oh my god, no way. It's Elder. Is it Elder? <laughs> so now he is A1 Elder. This account, bro. Thor. Oh my god. This account, dude. Are we hot or are we hot? D hot dang. What in the heck is going on? He's got A A1 Elder. He's got Uranin. He's got Cyrus. Now the pity resets. That is correct. A1 Elder. Elder has amazing awakenings too. That is just too strong. We gotta get him Ardia now. That's the only thing that can make this crazy. Yeah, that's our second exclusive Legendary Lord today. That's our third Legendary Lord. <laughs> that's our 13th Legendary. We are piping hot. My gosh. Alright, we got four more here. Alright, so he'll be 74 into pity if we don't get another one. But at this rate, maybe we're gonna get one or two more Legendary Lords. I don't know. And look at that. What do I say? Sorzis is lucky. Double Sorzis. It's no coincidence, folks. It's no coincidence. Can we go for three? Can we get our third? Oh my god! <laughs> Don't sleep on Carnelian, guys. Because Carnelian is super strong on a chaotic team. We've pulled about a million chaotic units, and she's really, really good with Uridin, right? Because uh, she's going to keep him alive, but keep his health nice and low. So he's going to get all his amazing chaotic benefits. That is crazy. The rates are rating. That is so good, guys. We're building a whole team for him through these pulls. This is crazy. This is craziness. We're, we might get more. We might get more. That's our fourth one. Oh, my goodness. We still got 60 more pulls. Let's go, baby. Let's go. I'm, I'm convinced I'm going to get all rares for my 33 pulls now. I mean, there's no way we didn't waste all. There's no way I didn't waste all my luck. Well, double double epic lord round. We will take it. I think he's getting A5. If he didn't have A5 Vladov, he's getting it by the end of this. That's the third Vladov. Third or fourth Vladov we've pulled. 
All right, 50 remain. We gotta stick with the 10 pulls. I mean, they're working, right? They are just working. Let's see it. <laughs> oh my God, I wanna curse. You know I don't curse in my videos, but I wanna curse. What is going on? <laughs> I don't know, A1 Uridin. Holy crap, everybody better like and subscribe. Like the stream, subscribe to my channel. This is insane. So maybe we all need to save 204 Ancient Summons. This is ridiculous. That's our fifth legendary. We pulled two Uridin, we pulled Cyrus, we pulled Carnelian, and we pulled him A1 Elder. Like, what is even going on? Honestly, what is even going on? And we're not done. Like, what is even going on? What the heck? So A1 is going to endure the effect of unyielding granted by Arbiter of Death. That's his passive. Increases attack speed by 200. And when the unyielding ends, he gains 50% HP. So instead of dying potentially after the unyielding and staying about to die, instead he gets half his health back. That's insane. And 200 attack speed is nothing to sneeze at. That could easily be 0.4 or 0.5 seconds off of his, uh, off of his attack interval. That is just ridiculous. Yeah, people that are tempted to spend right now don't think this is all, always how it goes. This is insane. Yeah, AJ's asleep. Oz is saying for sure AJ fainted. This is insane. This is actually insane. By the way, he pulled Pelagius two weeks ago, so he actually has all the 10x heroes now. But we got to go get an A2 Uridan or an A1 Cyrus or an A1 Pelagio or something. I mean, what is going on? We still have 40, 40 more pulls. We still have 40 more pulls. <laughs> what is going on? What is going on? What is going on? There's a soul there. We're, every time we don't get a legendary, we still get an epic lord. I'm, I can't even think about how many points we're going to have. 30 more. 30 more. My sweet, sweet, sweet god. Oh my gosh. This is crazy. <laughs> AJ is dead. <laughs> Jackson calls the account if AJ died. All right, we got 20 more. This is the home stretch. We're going to do 10 pulls because they've been working way better for us, obviously. Uh, there, Of course, let's get another Ein. Another Isolde. Why not? This is crazy. These rates are outrageous. All right, we got to wrap this up. This is It's too much for my heart to bear. This is craziness. How did we pull five legendaries? This is just ridiculous. <laughs> wow. Wow. Well, there we have it, guys. There we have it. So we did 204 Ancients. And to recap, boy, did we do well. Let's just recap everything we did today, and we'll wrap it up. I mean, I am, this is unreal. So let's go to the bottom, our unleveled ones, and we'll see. We got two Uridin, because of course, why not get two Uridin, right? We got Sadie. He already had A5 Sadie. We got Azor. I said I wasn't going to say his name, but we can say it now. It's over. Two Aelin. Why not get him another Elder? He already had Elder, so now we can have A1 Elder to go along with his A1 Uridin. We got him A5 Valeria. Carnelian, amazing. Going to work really well with the uh, chaotic teams. We got him A1 Tordor, a brand spanking new Cyrus. He got a new Regulus, which blows my mind based on his account. We got A4 Comet. We're going to have to check the Calypso. And then we got A4 or A3 Allura. I want to check his Calypso. And we got him A2 Calypso. All right. Great stuff. I, I know AJ is very happy. Uh, this was a unique situation that we had, you know, we were doing a bunch of blue summons and then we had 55 divines and we had, and we had 204 ancients. That is nuts. And the party's not over. I'm going to wrap this one up right here, but I'm going to stay live on stream because I'm going to head onto my account where I have 33 ancients. And I just, I really hope, I pray to R and Jesus that a touch of this luck carries over to me. Oh my God. And we have to check the points. Arrival of heroes. He went to first place. What are we at? A cool, even 57,000 points. My sweet God. He's going to get another Ancient. He's going to get a Legendary Summoning Crystal. That is just ridiculous. 57,000 points. When I did my 800 Summons and my 12 Divines, I got 39,000 points. So that just shows you the power of what we just did and also doing 55 Divines. I mean, that never hurt. All right. That is just nutty. Apparently, he got an achievement. So let's see what his achievement is own five lord heroes of different factions so five legendary lord heroes so and that's five more ancients which i don't think we're gonna pull now because i don't want to test our luck 
Let's just save it. Darren says this is the best pulling ever done. We'll claim that for him. We can save it for another time. Uh, but it's definitely worth mentioning. He's already 74 into his next legendary Lord Pity. So truly crazy. Thank you so much for watching. I've been Vasilis. If you like my stuff, like it, subscribe, share with your mother, get in the comments. I'll see you in the next one. Fast Didius.